Yeah, good day. This is Chibuzago and this is Logi for Tech Channel, like you already know. You know, in my last video, I actually bumped upon, yes, I just bought a new Infinix Source 8 and I told you that once I go through the phone, I'll be showing you something different. If you could recall sometime last year, yes, I did a video on how to block and unblock numbers on Infinix phones, yes. And I could remember in the comment section, some people do comment that, Hey Chibuzo, I can't really find the X Manager and I want to block a particular number. Oh, I can't find the X Manager app on my phone. Yes, that is quite correct. If you could recall, I shoot so I made that video from an Infinix Hot Light, Hot Four Light. Yes, if I can remember, yes, Hot Four Light. And in the Hot Four Lights, you know that there is an app, the X Manager, by which you that I think it gives you access to block and unblock number. But I remember that. Well, somebody I can't really recall where you commented from, but you say that hey Chibuza, I can't find the X manager on my phone and I want to block a particular number. Yes. You're quite correct. And I also told you that once I lay my hands on something useful for you, I will shoot or I'll make a video for you. And that is what I am doing right now. Um I'm actually making this video from the new phone I just got, which I shoot so the last video I showed you as in during the unboxing, yes, it's an Infinix Hot 8. I don't really want to make a review about that. But let's now go to the business of the day, how to block and unblock numbers using Infinix Hot 8 and an app which you can't necessarily find in the old versions of Infinix. And maybe that's the reason why that complaint or that comment came from. So I would like to let you know, if you're the person that made that comment, that there is a particular app in a newer version of Infinix, which you can use to block and unblock numbers easily, just like the X Manager. Yeah, maybe you bought a new Infinix phone, maybe from the X5, S4, or probably you don't have the X Manager app in your phone. Yes, you can actually still block and unblock numbers using what the Phone Master app. I guess you might have bumped across it, and maybe you never know its use yet. And that is why I'm making this video for you to know that you can easily block and unblock numbers using the phone master app the same way you did with the X manager so let's go and kindly note like I said if you don't have the X manager in your Infinix phone you will be making use of what the phone master app and the phone master app is is just a little bit similar with the X manager it has the shield if you could see from this screen yeah this very view the second row and the first as in the second app on the second row Yes, that is a phone master app. You can see the name written boldly. So what you will do is that you just kindly click on the phone master app. Yes, it will launch. Yes, this is how the app looks like. You can see phone master. You can do so many things with the phone master app, just like the X manager. But basically, I'll be teaching you how to unblock and unblock numbers. So my memory is a stream person. You let me just. Yes, and 25% story. That is not the business of this. So now you are in the phone master app as you can see now what she will do if you should look at the base you see three icons where you find the home you find the toolbox and also me i don't really want to go to the me aspect but aspect path so what you will do now is to click on what the toolbox which will now take you to this view as you can see in the toolbox you can do so many things you can smart clean up your phone you can deep clean you can uninstall app you can also manage your notification, you can clean your WhatsApp, you can move files, but that is not what we are looking for. We want to learn how to block and unblock numbers. So now, the next thing you will do is to scroll downwards as I'm moving until you get to the portion of harassment filter. You can see from the data manager they have the harassment, harassment filter. So what you do, you click on harassment filter, and yes, if you could not is just similar with that of the X manager, yes. And that's basically the reason why it does the same function. So now we are in the harassment filter. As you can see, there is no number. I haven't blocked no numbers at the moment. So now what you will do, you you can toggle, just toggle to the area of blacklist. The list is empty. So now you move to the bottom and just click add. Now it gives you uh Two options either you want to add from your phone contact or you want to impute manual if you want to add from your con phone contact click add then you scroll to your contact in your phone and you select a particular number and you click ok but I'm, I don't want to add from my contact because I want to test with a particular number of mine which is on another phone so let's go I will go back 
and click add and say input manually so now i will be inputting the number manually just like i did so this is the number i want to block so that we can see if it actually works so you click ok so this number has been blocked in the block list section as you can see the number has been added so if this the, 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 you can see you can toggle between the block list and the phone so the phone aspect will actually show you the number if as in the amount of times that that particular number that you have block list calls you you actually see the number of times if it is 10 it will be displayed so let's put that to test what i will do at the moment is to go back to my home screen yeah let me go back to my home screen let me call that number i'm dialing my other phone at the moment so i want to die from that number that i just block listed and let me see if it will ring so i'm dialing let me put it on loudspeaker so that you can hear as you can see it just as i said it just showed li uh, line bz without no significant ring on this very phone let me dial it for the second time so that will attest the number of times that i dialed then it blocked again it didn't connect that just it i've dialed it the second time and let me go one more time so that will make it three let me go and this is the third time it has bad this number or the number that i added in the block list from calling it so now you can see which simply means that even if the person dials your number a hundred times, you wouldn't even have an effect that so, 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 so person or anybody is calling you. So now let's check. Let's do a check. So now to check if the person actually called while he or she is on the block list, you still go back to the phone master app. It's loading, it's loading, then the same process just like you did the first time. You go to the toolbox. Then you scroll down, scroll down, scroll down, scroll down, so you get to the harassment filter. So you can see, I told you I dialed the number three times, and this is the three exact times that was displayed on the phone. As you can see, and if you should check, it covers the, as in the, the exact time that that person dialed your phone. And you notice that you don't even have a single notification that says, so person is calling you. So, but actually, the reason why it's keeping this record is for you to actually go back and see, oh, so this is a person, oh, let me say Mike, oh, you're a spammer, I don't want to receive a call from you. And you've done me three times, and there's the three times that it's appearing. The number is still on the block list, as you can see. And this is the third three times that that particular number dies. So you can just empty it so that you can reschedule and see how many times that person calls you once again. So you can see it's as easy as ADC, which means that you don't have to install any additional apps, any, any call or SMS blocker app, just like we did with the Infinix Hot 4 Lite in my video of last two years, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. So now you can see that mm, if you're one of the person that asked, oh, how can I block the numbers? I don't have X manager on my Infinix phone. Well, the answer is here, right there in Phone Master. You know, as the process go by, more updates have been made, the software has been upgraded and you have to that's a do away with the older ones and maybe that's the reason why Infinix Mobility have to say, Oh, let's come up with something new. Yes, and that's why they introduce what the phone master. So if you're using an Infinix Hot Eight, Hot Eight Pro, Infinix um, S four, S five or whatsoever and you want to block and unblock a number, simply use what? The phone master app. Now maybe after some while you say oh i'm tired of blocking let me say still mike oh let me just open this number so that he can come across or reach me so now you still do the same process you go back to the phone master now you're unblocking that very number or i am trying to unblock that very number that i blocked earlier on so now i still go back to the phone master tap on toolbox scroll 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 go to harassment filter then you now move to the block list page all you simply do you could see the icon that is next to the number which is the delete icon or the trash bin icon just click on it 
Then to now ask you delete this number, you just say yes, delete, and that is all. That is all. The number is gone, as you can see. So now let me test if that number can actually get in touch with this phone as I have removed it from the block list. So I'm trying to dial my number using the other number. Let's see if it will ring this time. Just bad at all, yeah. So you could see how easy it is to block and unblock numbers still using your Phoenix phone, but this time around with what the phone master app. So if you are making use of a new version of Infinix or an updated version or the new phones that Infinix just created, actually you know that they've done after this and they've done away with the X Manager app. So this time around you'll be making use of what the phone master app. So that is that. You can see that how useful it is at this time around. So go ahead and block that spammer that you don't want to get in touch with you. Maybe there is a particular person you've blocked and you want to open. I think you want to release his contact so that he can be able to contact you. You can do the same process. So that is that. And at this, uh, this juncture, we have come to the end of this video. So what you kindly do is hit the subscribe button. Yes, maybe this is the first time of visiting my YouTube channel. You notice that I normally give tutorials on phones and on the general informa information technology world. Yes, information and communication technology. And also, I did beat with any useful information across the world. So just kindly hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell notification so that you'll be the first to get notified whenever I release similar video just like this. And like I told you during the unboxing, I said I'll still go through the phone and maybe. If there are any other tips or tricks, I will still let you know so that you will get used to them. Yes, if you're using that as particular, if you're using an Infinix Heart 8. Yes, and that is that. So, Chibuza Agora remains my name. I'm blogging for Tech Remains the channel. Hit the subscribe button before you leave. And thank you. So, we'll meet again in the next video. Bye-bye for now.